hello guys welcome back again to my channel i know it's been a long time since i put on a video yes yeah, so yeah so i've really been busy with school with work with home and you know everything just combined in one and it just made me very very busy and life has been really time consuming but hey i'm here I'm here with you. If this is your first time watching my video, please don't leave my channel without subscribing for more videos like this. So a little bit about me, I'm a nursing student. Uh, I'm in my first semester of nursing school and I'll be graduating with my Bachelor of Science in Nursing. So it's been quite some time I posted videos. Uh, I really enjoy doing videos but the thing is it is very time consuming and uh, you know uh, school has really drained my time away from YouTube but so yeah uh, I'm here again uh, and today's video I'm just giving you guys <coughs> an update uh, into my first semester of nursing how it is what is going on uh, because the semester is coming to an end so I have just like I think a month or less to be finished with my first semester of nursing I'm gonna break it down for you guys especially for those that are looking forward into going to nursing and again if this would be your first semester in nursing so you can you know at least get a little bit idea about how your first semester of nursing school will be like. So, <clears throat> my first semester of nursing school, guys, <sighs> it was tough. Let me tell you guys how, like, let me tell you guys the raw truth. It was tough. I mean, tough in the sense, like, it was time consuming. If you have enough time, and you study it's not it's not that bad but the problem is timing like you can even if you have 24 hours it still it seems like it's still not enough for you guys to do you know all the assignments you know quizzes exams you know it's a lot for you know it's a lot to be honest with you and the good thing that actually really helped me a little bit is because um, I'm an LPN, so I kind of have an idea of what is going on. And so for the first semester, you do not choose your classes and you do not choose your schedule. You are given a schedule already made. I think it's more like a master schedule for everybody, especially your first semester of nursing. I don't know about the second semester, but for the first semester, we were not allowed to choose our classes or choose our time. So uh, I am taking three classes and those three classes are equal to 12 credit courses. So I'm taking fundamentals of nursing, I'm taking health assessment and I'm taking pharmacology. With fundamental of nursing is equal to six credit courses for me um because it's divided into three sections we have a lecture lecture takes three hours a week we have clinicals clinicals is eight hours also per week uh, we go from 7 a.m up to 3 30 and then i'm gonna talk more about the clinicals later on in the video and then for a uh, lab lab takes four hours per week as well so all of that equals to like six credit for fundamentals of nursing alone and with fundamentals we just did the basic you know they would teach you guys how to uh, insert an iv line how to put in a fully you know passing medication just the basic getting you ready for medical surgical nursing uh, because that's the core so yeah fundamental was kind of interesting uh, to me i actually learned a lot and then for health assessment we mostly did like assessment of child 
you know we assess the eyes we assess all the body systems and from them in health assessment just need to practice practice and practice a lot of practice especially in health assessment i found health assessment a little bit challenging because <clears throat> there's a lot about it just like for example about the eye there's a lot about the eye that you need to know uh, the lectures were three hours uh, lecture once a week and the lab is uh, four hours once a week as well. And then we move on to pharmacology. Pharmacology is kind of interesting as well. Uh, pharmacology uh, is equal to three credit courses for me and we have just lecture, it has no lab. So we have lecture once a week, uh, three hours as well so you guys can kind of like see how my week goes i go to school from monday to friday um some days i go from eight o'clock to four p.m and then other days i go just for lab and then on clinical days i go to clinicals you know in the morning from six or seven to like three p.m and then sometimes you have to stay after school we have group project to do we have assignments to do as groups so it is really hectic but it's doable if you have that time and if you are really organized <coughs> which i believe is a trick to succeeding in nursing school guys you have to be organized and then you'll be fine when it comes to assignment quizzes and exams <coughs> some classes we have like for health assessment, we have uh, quizzes every lecture. Like if I have health assessment on Wednesday, we have quizzes every Wednesday before the start of the class. And for fundamentals, we have quizzes to We have quizzes every class. So most of the classes, we have quizzes every day of the class. And for exams, we have exam maybe every other week or every other three weeks. Um, and then assignments, law guys, like the assignment is, the assignment takes like more than half of your time. Um, they give us a lot of assignments, like so much assignment guys to be done, like so much, like you will sit on the chair for hours doing assignments listening to videos, answering questions, doing a lot of practice questions. Um, you know, it's, yeah, for assignment, it's kind of heavy on that. And then for our testing, we use ATI testing, guys. Uh, I never for once thought, after taking my teeth, I never for once thought I was ever gonna lay my eyes on ATI but lord and behold i am here trying to make friends with ati and to be really honest with you it's not that bad if you kind of get used to ati and you get used to how they answer their questions how their questions are being said and what they are asking for uh you know it's not bad um if you take me back for my teeth test i think i might do a little bit better than what i did before because i've kind of like known their tricks how they answer their questions how they want you to respond so yeah all my assignments come from ati unless uh some assignments that is uh, like a case study and just other stuff but quizzes exams all assignments videos they all come from ati and it's very intense and it makes you stronger it makes you you know want to give up it makes you feel like oh my gosh like what am i doing you know but it i mean you know it keeps us on our toe and i really like that challenge and how do i study for my first semester in nursing school i really don't have like a specific uh you know i don't really don't have like a specific source that i used to study i just study wherever i feel you know uh you know i just study like wherever i feel i want to study for that day but mostly i do practice questions 
So my first sauce that I will use any time like on a go, like a time saver that I use maybe every day is this bad boy right here, guys. Like this is what I use. Is it the Sanders NCLEX RN examination review, guys? Listen, listen to me, okay? If you are heading into that nursing program and your first semester, your second semester, or your third semester, I don't care. Get this book right here, guys. Like, get this book. Everything is condensed into this little book. Everything about nursing school is in here. This is everything about nursing school. Forget about those big books you see. <clears throat> Just forget about them, okay? Everything you see in that big book, you see in here. I think this book, the way they kind of, uh, you know, wrote this book is they just put like the information that we, we need to know. They don't put everything that is not relevant. They put just the relevant information. <clears throat> like for fundamentals, you can see this is fundamental. This is all about fundamentals. Like, you know, this is all about fundamentals. Like, can you believe it? Look at this is all we have our fundamentals so when i'm in a hurry when i'm tired if i don't have time to sit down and go you know if i don't have time to sit down and go over pages upon pages i grab this bad boy right here like this is my lifesaver so that is what i use like to study and again i kind of like do some practice questions here and there i go to ati ati is really a good source for studying because they have even videos you know they have everything there that can help you succeed all you need to do is invest your time into all of those and you will just be fine all right let me talk to you guys about clinicals <coughs> With clinicals, I'm kind of liking clinicals. We go to nursing home. We are divided into groups, like group of eight or group of twelve, and we go to different clinical sites on different days. Um, we started clinicals two months to the program, so we have about eight weeks. We had about eight weeks of clinicals. And we go from 7 a.m. up to 3.30 p.m. And uh, when we go to clinicals, we have a pre-conference. We have, and we also have a post-conference. You know, and then we go on the floor. When we arrive at our clinical site, we have a pre-conference. We go to the room and the instructor would assign us the patient. And we talk about what we are supposed to do that day. And, you know, we talk about what we are supposed to do that day and we move on the floor, we assign a patient and then at the end of the day we go and, you know, for a for post-conference. And it's kind of interesting. We do a lot of, like, hands-on. We do assessment, you know, we assess patient, we look at medication, we look at their diagnosis, we, like, just go over their chart and just to get to know, you know, the patient that we are assigned to better. Um, and I think it's kind of interesting, to be honest with you, because all what we do in lab, we learn on the mannequin, and here are we, you know, actually doing the real thing with, the, with real people. So, yeah, it's kind of interesting. If you guys want me to talk in details about my clinical experience, what to expect, you know, and all of that. Uh, I can make a separate video for that because I don't want this video to be too long. <clears throat> yeah, guys. So that's going to be it for this video. I just thought of, like, coming here to, you know, update you guys about my first semester, how it's going, am I coping? And yes, guys, I am trying. I'm not, I will not say I'm gonna you know i'm aiming for the best but it's tough so i'm trying that's all i can say thank god i'm not failing that's the good news and i'm looking forward to my second semester in january so um if you have any question about this video if if there is anything that you want to know that I did not mention that you want to ask me, you feel free to ask me. My email is always down below. 
and uh, you can also leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel and uh, i'll see you guys again next in my video and see you then bye